Guys, thank you so, so, so much for the support on yesterday's video. You know, the serious video. But we're back with a normal video today, guys. And again, thank you. I don't know what else to say. You guys are literally the best. And you motivate me to continue to make videos, guys. So thank you so much. I fucking love you all. Full homo. Now enjoy this video, bitch. What's good, motherfuckers? My name is James, or Jeeves Gamer, and today I'm bringing you guys the school rant number two. Now, you guys know in the previous school rant, I said a few of the ideas. Now, if I think of more, I will turn it into a school slash education rant number two. We'll do another one. That's right, guys. I said if I remember anything more, I will put it into a school rant number two. And here we fucking are. Let's go. Now, this may not apply to most of you guys, but it applies to me. Now, if you're in college, that means you're at least 16 to 17 years old, meaning you're becoming an adult. And these college lecturers still have the cheek to treat us like children. Like there's someone in my college class who's 25 years old. He's 25, and they still treat him like a child. Now, do you want to know why they treat him like a child or treat us like children? Jeeves, just stop with the atrocious banter. Now, have you guys ever heard of a seating plan? I'm pretty sure you do know exactly what I'm talking about when I say seating plan. Because I'm pretty sure most of you guys are younger than me and still, you know, need to be whipped into shape because you're a bad kid. No, I'm only joking, man. Now, I'm 18 years old and teachers want to put me in a seating plan because I talk. Not just me, but the whole class talks. We're a bunch of young adults and you put us in a seating plan because we talk too much. Talk about freedom. Now, freedom doesn't exactly exist in college, does it? If you're putting us in a seating plan, that's ridiculous. Like, do you think by putting us in a seating plan, we're going to stop talking? Motherfucker, we'll shout across the classroom. Or if that don't work, I'll bust out my phone and I'll text my friends. That's how fucking sad I am. But if you're putting me in a seating plan, I'm going to protest. Hashtag fuck your seating plan. Now, something else that makes me feel like a child is the fact that I have to ask to use the bathroom. Now I already spoke about this in my previous rant, but I didn't speak about this specifically. Now asking to go to the toilet has got to be the most ridiculous thing. I'm 18 years old and I have to ask if I can go to the toilet to piss. No, I just get up and go. Now let's take our attention away from lecturers and teachers and move over to pupils. Now other pupils can be dickheads. Now specifically, I'm talking about bullies. Now you may think, because you've watched my crazy school experiences, you may think that I'm a bully, but no, I am far from it. I am the most kindest person you'll ever meet and I have time for everyone. Sorry, I just had to throw that out there. I'm no bully, man. I love you guys. But don't you think bullies are the worst type of people in this world, guys? They get satisfaction from putting other people down. Just know, guys, if you're a victim of bullying, I fucking love you and I hate bullies. Me and you will stand together and we'll go and fuck this bully up, alright? Like, on a serious note, guys, let's fucking go. Let's go and get this bully. And what exactly are you going to do, you skinny little prick? Do you know what else fucks me off about certain pupils at school, guys? That's right, guys. That one motherfucker that thinks he's cool, but no. He's a fucking idiot. He puts everybody else down to make himself feel better. Basically a bully. But no, he thinks he's cool. He's a faggot. Basically, he's a bully. Jesus, jeez, get your words out. But you guys get exactly what I'm saying, right? These horrible people that think they're cool and just put other people down just to make themselves feel better. Now picture this, guys. There's one cool kid that everyone looks up to. And let's say I'm friends with him. And there's this one person that wants to be friends with him. So now this person will start licking my ass just so they can get closer to this cool person. Don't you just hate these type of people, guys? This happens wherever. It will happen at work or it'll happen at school. Now, I just experienced it personally at school. People would lick my ass just so they could get closer to the cooler kid. Do you get what I'm saying, guys? Fuck them people. But guys, that's pretty much been the Jeeves Game of School Rant number two. Now, there's probably even more stuff. That I forgot, so if I remember anything, you know what's happening, the school rant number three. But guys, if you did agree with what I said and you are with me against these fucking bullies and these immature teachers that treat us like children, then make sure you slap a like on the video. It would mean the world to me if we could get this video to 20 likes. And guys, make sure you subscribe if you're new around here. Do it!